have a, a married couple here. They're celebrating their anniversary kind of a little bit late. And so, if you would help me in welcoming up Natasha and Todd to the stage. Come on up. That's welcome. Come on. Give them a hand. Welcome. I wouldn't come up to that either. Don't forget about that. Woo! You should have some music. Isn't she lovely? Todd, right over here. It's Todd, right? I want to call you Rob for some reason, but Todd is your name. All right. Go ahead and have a seat. I promise not to embarrass you on purpose. We did a little fun for you. Been married three years, yeah? Yeah. Congratulations. That's awesome. That's awesome. Uh, something special we're going to attempt to do, uh, and I'm going to start with you if that's okay. Um, okay, fair enough. I'm just going to run my, uh, my finger down the corner like this. You tell me when to stop, and we'll get you a card, okay? All right. Right there. Okay, let's take this one. Now, I don't want you to see this yet, okay? So if you would turn away, and I'll, I'll let you all see it. And what I want you to do is sign your name across there. And do you remember the day you guys met? You do? Could you write that on there as well? The day you met. Do you remember the month? Okay. And how about the year? <laughs> okay, I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll do this. <laughs> See, I was trying to give him the easy question and give you the hard one because, you know, I'm a guy and I want to help the guy out and want him to be successful. So I'll tell you what, write your name across there and then put today's date on there. Fair enough? Okay, perfect. See, always an out, always an out. October 30th. October 30th, 2013, in the year of our Lord. How to build suspense. <laughs> You're not looking yet, are you? All right. Perfect. You have neat handwriting. We you get older. All right. Thank you for your capping that. All right. So here's her card. Don't say it. Okay. And her name and the date. Okay. All right. Got it. Especially you, young man. All right. So here's what we're going to do. Uh, we're going to lose that in the pack, and uh, you're going to try and find it. Now, earlier, Philemon said something that's interesting. He said there's, well, we'll get to that. Now, you met her on a, day, on a certain day in a certain time in a certain year. It was a magical meeting, right? Okay? Sparks commenced and your face cut off. Never mind. Okay. So here's what, you get one chance to find her just like that time. So give the deck just a simple cut. And we'll mark your spot. We'll get back to that in a minute. Now, what Philemon said earlier is there's 52 cards in a deck and there's 52 weeks in a year, right? And in one of those weeks in a certain year, which we don't remember, they met. <laughs> Thanks for laughing. Come to all my shows. You guys met. Perfect. Now, let's see how you did. You had one chance to find her then. You have one chance to find her now. Congratulations. Great job. Give them a round of applause. That's amazing. Signed card out of 52. That's pretty cool, huh? Yeah. Let's see how excited you are. I'll tell you what, we'll take the, uh, the four of hearts and we'll place that right in here. And now it's your turn. I'm just going to do this. You tell me when to stop and we'll get you a card right there already. You sure? Okay. That's a nice card. Fair enough. In fact, you stop at two of them. And it's okay if you see this. Uh, I want you to go ahead and sign your name somewhere where we can see it on that. And I want you to put the day of your wedding on. I gave him the easy question. You would remember that one, right? The date or the date? The date. Well, it's probably a Saturday. It usually goes Saturday, so we're pretty safe there. Was it a Saturday? No, of course not. <laughs> <laughs> That's all right. So. Was it June? What day was it? June. October 20-something. 18th. Okay, and what year? Three years ago, in the 2010, right? Perfect, okay. Now, you can't really read that very well because he actually stopped on the ace of spades and he wrote into the, uh, the spade, but that's okay. We're going to take that card and, uh, let's see, we'll place that one right in here. Fair enough? And we'll read that for up. Now, we've got two cards, signed by two different people, in two different places in the back, okay? Would you do me a favor and uh, hold out your hand right here? And lean in, because I'm going to have her hold hers right above yours. Would you, would you go ahead and hold your hand right above his? Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take these cards, 
and I'm going to square them up, place them in your hand. Will you put your hand over that? Isn't that a beautiful picture? Yeah. Now, do you know any magic words? Abracadabra. Abracadabra. What'd you say? Abracadabra. No, you said peanut butter. <laughs> <laughs> he said peanut butter and jelly. I like it. But actually, the, the magic, the magic's in the magician. But on your wedding day, you guys said some magic words, didn't you? Did you say the words I do on that day? You did? You looked lovingly into each other's eyes and said those words. So we're going to reenact that moment for everybody here today. If you look lovingly into each other's eyes and say those words, Perfect. And in that moment, all that was holy between man and God became one, and the two have become one. Would you raise your hand and check out your cards? Go ahead and take them out. Check them out. Look at them, turn them over. The two have become one. You're signing for the hearts. 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 You're signing that's a wonderful souvenir of our time together this evening. Give them a great big round of applause. Thank you very much for coming up.